This is the first trout caught on a fly in this bit of stream for perhaps 160 years. After releasing it unharmed, I could reflect on how it came to be there, in the heart of the industrial city of Sheffield. You see, sometime between 1853 and 1891, this whole section of stream was buried in a pipe. Fast forward to 2015, and it was time to dig it out again. For over a century, this brick tunnel had entombed the Porter Brook, until Sheffield City Council backed plans to open it up and create a public park. Taking the lid off the stream was a dramatic step and formed part of a challenging engineering project. The digging work unearthed archaeological remains that needed to be recorded before work could continue. And the straight, shallow channel needed some help to create good habitat for wildlife. Careful shaping of the riverbed enabled new channel features to be created. And using specialist habitat expertise, the Wild Trout Trust was able to direct simple actions on site that work with the river to create much more valuable habitat. For example, knowing exactly where to pin a tree trunk to the riverbed ensured that the sloping cobble bar features could be retained during high flows. Rock rolls were used by contractors to stabilise berm features that were planted with native vegetation. and rock that was excavated on site during the creation of the park was placed into the channel to create diverse flow, bed scour and gravel retention. Knowing just how to arrange boulders in the channel helped to create the right opportunities for different life cycle stages of trout. as well as many more species in this urban stream ecosystem.